Reaper, we keep it rough, we keep it raw, we keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper, because I'm doing very good things here at Reaper. Alright, let's get to the topic. Are some women witches? The Reaper don't like to call a woman a, di <laughs> a derogatory name. We don't like to use derogatory names to describe women. So, um, we call them witches because we just call out the evil that some women do. Not all women, but some women, and we call them witches. Just like when a woman be manipulative and, you know, uh, tell a woman, young woman, that she doesn't need a man or how to control her man or what she would take or what she wouldn't take or, you know, uh, that the dude is probably cheating. You a witch! You know, the Reaper keep it 1,000. You's a low-down witch. Because you should be teaching a woman to coexist with a man. And if she's got a decent man, there may be some, you know, bumps in the road or whatever. But if they can get through them, you should be teaching her how to act instead of how to get rid of her man and how she don't need her man because you're jealous of their relationship because when you was younger you had a man and most of you women be devious envious you be jealous of a woman that's got a man you just say evil witch but you know that's what you are you're a witch and we're gonna call you out today and some of you women be talking about a man should not control you or whatever. Well, a brother sent me some scriptures today and I'm going to read them off because, you know, uh, I think that this is from the Creator. This ain't from the Reaper. This is from the Creator. You know, uh, let's see what it says. Let the woman learn in silence with all subjection, but I suffer not a woman to teach nor should she absurd authority over a man, but be in silence. Adam was first form, then Eve. And Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in transgression. So she was in sin, and this is 1 Timothy 2.11 through 2.14. So the woman was in sin... You know, uh, and being deceived by the serpent because she wasn't working with her man. She was working against him and listening to another man. And you should never listen to another man when you got your man. Woman come in and say, well, the motivational speaker said this, like Kevin Samuel said, I should do this, that, and the other. Or pastor said, I should do this, that, and the other. Because my pastor, you know, I wish you would tell me what pastor said, you know. Because no woman of mine is going to be led by another man, a.k.a. pimp, to get her money, you know, like these motivational speakers do. And tell her what she should do with me and what I should be doing with her. You know, when she get her understanding, right? She got to come to the Reaper. The Reaper keep it 1,000, you know. But a lot of you women be wanting to absurd authority, you know, over a man. And you want, you know, uh, you know to be in control, the reaper keep it 1,000, and you feel challenged by a man, you know, a man that's got himself together, you use that nasty word, narcissist, and then it's a nasty word of entitlement that you feel, some of you, that a man should do, uh, he should do for you, you don't feel appreciative of his hustle, the reaper keep it 1,000, and that makes you a witch, you know, the Reaper keep it 1,000. But anyway, let me read another passage. And then we're going to let you guys go and think about some things and go back to work. Because, you know, we just here to educate with some tools that you can use. It says, the aged woman, likewise, that they be in behavior as becoming the holiness 
not false accusers, not giving too much wine, teachers of good things, that they may teach the young women to be sober, to love their husbands, to love their children. See? That's what the older women is supposed to do. You're supposed to teach the young women to love their husbands and their children. Instead of, you know, working against their husbands. Like, girl, you should get rid of him. And if I was you, I wouldn't take all this, that, and the other off of him. He controlling you. And if that was my man, I wouldn't be doing this, that, and the other. You're nothing but a witch when you teach that. The Bible says that you're not in holiness. You know, or teaching your, teaching a young woman to control, you know, her man because you jealous because you done ran through men or, you know, you done ran away men and could no man coexist with you. So you try to crab the young woman. I don't know if y'all ever saw Poetic Justice, but it was the woman that owned the salon and Janet Jackson and Tupac had good genuine chemistry and love between us and she was jealous she was always talking about Tupac and how she wouldn't be with him and his breath stink and how he was this way and that way and she was just jealous cause she told her all I do is dress and rest baby cause love don't live here anymore and that's the way it is with some of you older women crabbing these young women cause even when I saw even when you was young right you always had some type of man, and this is why you're bitter, and you teach this to the younger women that I'm strong, I'm independent, I don't need a man, or whatever. No, it ain't that you don't need a man, you want a man, it's just that you can't coexist with a man because you can't change your witch-like behavior, you know, or you can't change some of the things that a quality man you know, uh, won't accept from you, you know, the reaper keep it 1,000, and you can't change those things, you know, you're set in your ways, but you want a man just like the young woman wants a man, but you be deceivers, and you don't teach them to love their husbands and children, and likewise, you know, uh, like I said, you know, uh, you know, uh, the children have to be taught to love the man. You know, they're going to have a certain connection with mom anyway because she's the nurturer and she carried them for nine months. And if she's in their life, you know, raising them, they're going to have a certain connection, you know, with her anyway. But the man, the children has to be taught to love the man and the woman, the young woman, it says she has to be taught to love her husband. The young woman does. So, you know, but if you're teaching her just the opposite, you're nothing but a witch. Reaper, we keep it rough. We keep it raw. We keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper. Because I'm doing good things here at Reaper. Enjoy your day. Reaper out. Peace.